Hi guys, this is Amnal and we are back playing Cards Fan 4. So the World War 2 is in a full swing and it's early March of 39 as you can see, that's mostly to our uh, defiant stance about Sudetenland and well, rightfully so because well, they haven't uh, as much as taken a button from our shield from there. And now we are, well, maybe not entirely on the offensive, but well, we are at least advancing in positions where we find not much in terms of uh, of defense. And well, it really seems like uh, Germany uh, has been caught off guard with this uh, so early on in, in 38. Um, because usually they can just eat Poland very easily. Uh, and uh, then what? Uh, in uh, early to mid uh, 1940, uh, steamer of France, but now they find themselves in, uh, uh, well, on them fighting on multiple fronts. And well, I mean, some of the fronts don't look so hot like this for France. I mean, they are holding, but not. It's it's looking a bit dicey. Oh uh, well. But here, for example, it seems that they were forced to pull out most of the uh, of the forces, and uh, even Siegfried line seems to be holding by a thread. Uh, of course, there is an issue with UK, so this is a bug that annoys the living hell out of me, which is that uh, your allies are not going to support you in any way, shape, or form by sending their troops to your territory unless their own territory uh, actually uh, borders the enemy. So if, for example, they somehow landed here and hold like one port, they would operate normally. But uh, since they have no direct contact with the enemy, they are not doing anything with their uh, with the ground troops basically so yeah that, that that's a problem and this whole fight as you can see is fought entirely by the uh, by the french uh, so far they are holding but that would be a pain in the ass if like uh, i really hope that this gets fixed because uh, this gets even more annoying so for example if uh, um, Let's assume, for example, Germany is gone, like it's three years later, Germany is gone and Soviet Union attacks the Allies, which uh, include Poland at the time. So no, uh, like, not a, uh, no one, like no France, nor United Kingdom, nor anyone else would actually support Polish forces on this border. Uh, as for as long as they they have no border with, uh, with Soviet Union, only if they somehow ended up bordering the Soviet Union, they would send the forces here, which is in fucking infuriating and silly and yeah. All right, runs over. It's been, it's been a bug forever, so I kind of hope they would fix it. They would have fixed it by now, but well. All right, uh, those, uh, those forces are being wasted and okay, you guys at least have some orders. Uh, this is a very difficult push, I think. Alright, so we'll just move through here and try to push towards the, the towards Munich, I think, rather than, than redeploying. Uh, uh. Okay. Oh, so another thing I actually messed up is this. Uh, the Yugoslavia actually isn't at war with Hungary because this is actually a separate war then, since well Hungary haven't joined uh, allies, uh, which well means that the, they will only be able to to attack through through here. So it's it's even more important to actually cut off Germany, which has too much on their plate right now. Oh, all right. Uh... Okay, maybe we'll be able to cut those two off, but that's once again is probably going to uh, to cut this front line. Hopefully not. 
Right, let's keep them on their toes and keep attacking towards the Nuremberg, I'd say. Hmm, that's not going very well. I mean, we are doing more. Oh, not really. No, we are not doing more damage. Alright, cancel this. Uh, we need like these two or three divisions for such things. Uh, we get pushed back from here, but that's okay. Uh, let's cross the river. Uh, uh, let's try to move through here. Alright. Okay, so we pushed through the river here, uh, and we get away. Mm. What do we have here? Only one? One division. So it's just a visual bug, apparently. Oh no, never mind. Those are, okay, those are attacking at this one. is not. Uh, well, he needs, he needs to rest anyway, so good for him. Uh, hmm. Okay, this one of you, uh, I'm going here, just go through here and try to, to do this cut through. Uh, I definitely want to grab this. Uh, no need to pick anything up from here just yet. Uh, I actually don't want to pick you, uh, you to go there. You can actually support this attack. Yeah, well, that's better. I, I know it's a mess with all that. Uh, the the front lights here, but uh, yeah, since the 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 hangar I think keeps messing them up, I and if I were to reassign them to to, to a different one, that would uh, simply uh, well on top of other things that would uh, remove the uh, their uh, current orders and their the important work. Oh damn it! Not all those attacks make sense, but the point is mostly to, to, to try to keep those units from pulling into those mountains. So we can actually uh, push through and see how that goes. Come on, grab this first. Oh, okay. Alright, so yeah. Let's see if they now they have an option to push in there, but yeah. Uh, Jesus, this nonsense again. Mm. Okay, try to try to just simply push through there. If we get that, we are golden. Uh, moving through here, yeah, that makes sense. It's wouldn't make sense to, to, to now push through that river, so yeah, let's just leave it as this. Uh, on the defensive, perfect. On the offensive here, also good. You guys uh, can keep pushing in this direction. No one is evacuating this bit, so that's great. Yeah. Uh, makes sense. This is, uh, well, more than even fight, so that's good. All right, working for us. All right, this uh, this bloody occupation have um, I can't deploy them yet. Oh, okay, that's this is going to be painful. Should I should we deploy something here? Huh. All right, yeah, let's redeploy one. How much suppression do we actually have? Uh, six, yeah. Nothing to write home about. Uh, okay, so we got pushed out of there. Okay, you know what? Let's actually redeploy you there as well. Uh, 
Mm -hmm. uh, right, let's unassign you. Yeah, there you go. Uh, now, this is a pain in the ass. Uh, yeah, actually, it seems like Innisbrook is not a kite at all, so that would be optimal. Alright, let's give it a try. Uh, still dancing your war. Well, of course they can't change it, but I mean... It's taking me a while to, 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 to realize how, how slow we are going right now. Alright, so that's that should be enough now. Good. Um, how's the repairing? Yeah, that's okay. Okay, so we can pretty much cancel that, I think. Alright, let's go. Huh. Alright, so uh, enemy air superiority reduction, minus 30. Uh, 13. From that, yeah, it gets it down to uh, 23%. A bit more manageable. Uh, now, yeah, I think I need to uh, support that attack and definitely uh, attack a bit uh, more heavily in that direction. Oh shit, okay, I got first out of from there, that's not good. Not good at all. Uh, no one's moving here, no one's moving here, alright. Uh, this is useful for the time being. Alright, actually, in Innsbruck now. Mm. Alright, we need to uh, take a breather here. Oh shit. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, this is this is bad. Uh <laughs> I forgot they were fighting here. I I shouldn't have a scare. Alright, so um, we are going to take this guy and just stretch redeploy him here. Okay. Actually, going to do the same with this guy. Because if they take over, if they take this over, uh, all right. Uh, another thing, uh, you guys just redeploy of them here to, to, to try to slow them down a little bit. Because those the three divisions are dead if, and this guy gets there first. All right, we get their superiority, some of it at least. Alright. Mm, okay, this is getting messy uh, by a minute. Uh, but this is getting empty too. Huh. Well, we don't know what's here. Well, there may be 50, 50 bloody divisions there, but. Not at all now. Alright, so. Let's just reassign on everything. And this needs... Right. And this is good. Yeah, that works. Let's cancel this and get some generic attack order here. So uh, if they are not doing anything, they, they at least get yeah, good picks of, uh, of planning bonus out of it. All right. Alright, so Poland refuses German ultimatum, they should go to war shortly. Uh, of course, I would love to have those several divisions uh, ready to, to strike, but uh, this is a nice prize here as well, so I'm not complaining. Uh, let's actually attack, so 
or like if you are confused why I'm attacking with low organization, so organization is basically binary. If you have organization, well, when it comes to actual combat, if you have organization at all, you are fighting with 100% capacity. If you don't have organization, you are not fighting. Uh, strength is uh, actually works the other way around so at 80 percent strength you are fighting at 80 percent capacity and so on and so forth only thing uh, on top of you know being broken and escaping the uh, lack of organization does is it slows you down if you are at low organization so that's where it's but uh, as far as the actual uh so you guys will be now assigned to this. Uh, when it comes to, like, to the damage and defense and whatnot, that it, it's not affected. This is now empty. Very dangerous. Uh, let's move one of you here. You, however... Uh, yeah, they, they, they frowned quite a lot and there are actually some Italians here too. To, to, to Italian infantry, could we perhaps push into there? That would be nice. Oh, just see. Uh, Alright, so if they actually go to war with Poland, and uh, they don't seem to do, okay, that they, they well, we'll see, maybe in a few days. Oh, uh, okay, yes, they actually went to, to war with Poland. Huh, alright, so... We may actually be almost in a position to push for Berlin. So now, like, now, like, our big goal is to push to Ashtetin and Berlin. So this is, like, our, uh, our plan maximum. And then... Uh, cut towards uh, Hanover and Bremen. Uh, everything's around here. Basically, we want to to uh, cut big parts of of German German army from from itself. Uh, let's see. Oh, right. And there there is a new thing that shows uh, estimated manpower. Uh, so you will probably see that those two have no manpower. Poland has no man power, and yeah, both Germany and Soviet Union have shitloads. Same goes for Italy, I imagine. Yeah, so we need to pick up the slack. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's let's actually try attacking. There's a lot of mud, well, not a lot, there's some mud there, so that's, that's problematic, but yeah, let's, let's try to push a little bit, uh, see how that goes. I still have, like, a limited amount of units that all those that we queued up ages ago are yet to finish, because, well, uh, it might take a long time, but actually it's, uh, uh, it's, it's just a few weeks here and there, a few days here and there that's all this uh, that this war is going actually it's it's quite a nice expansion we are we are having here considering you know the the fact that we are using only infantry Zuck submits to Italy doesn't really change anything does it uh, okay we can push through here actually perhaps all the way to Munich uh don't want to okay let's support this attack actually yeah slowly but surely yeah so that would leave only one uh, one province wide corridor for them which of course uh, of course is going this to make this corridor almost impossible to take uh, due to all the traffic but well Okay, so let's try to do it like this and actually support this attack. Uh, okay, so attacking Munich, uh, fairly 
difficult, but we've taken this bit and perhaps we'll get to uh, encircle it a little while, a little bit. You are probably going back here though, so... Hmm. Uh, no, just continue attacking here. Oh. Those those attacks. Uh, okay, so Poland is moving some of the troops here. Yeah, I think we can actually... Pull the troops all the way. Like that. I don't think they will be... Actually attacking with this. Want them to to stay in this pack. Perhaps we'll be able to cut uh, cut some of them off. But they want to to mount an attack from here towards perhaps Poznan, but mm, well, more likely Berlin and Shetin. Uh, if we were to cut out of whole Polish front here, that would be glorious. We aren't really in position though, so that that that's the issue and. Uh, Right, let's actually take all of that that we are moving that we are moving here and we want to make a new front line uh, have we made the new front line I don't think so all right so you know what let's make the, the that use that red one because this is like getting annoying okay let's All right, th this is of course very dangerous, leaving the this undefended. But well, at least we are not next to Prague, so let's I'm going to actually strategically deploy this. And then we'll try to push and see how that goes. Uh, all right, yeah, we are... <laughs> We'll need to redeploy like as soon and or if we manage to 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 actually uh, secure some decent position here. We'll just uh, probably get just get Munich and this pro those two provinces in Munich, and I would be happy. So we will just garrison those and move everything up north. Let's see how that goes for now. I mean, we're just trying to attack and see if there are positions that are fairly weak. Uh, right, can we already deploy? We cannot, so those those guys need to stay here, I'm afraid. All right, not anymore. All right, go. Everyone go there. Mm -hmm. Not bad for, what, 32 divisions that we have. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we are still using them to to push through here. Yeah, that's that makes sense actually. Let's continue s <laughs> sending them here. All right, can we actually please advance here? Then that would be. Very, very useful. All right, so we didn't manage to push for here. Uh, we're kind of winning here, so let's support this attack. Uh, okay, so you are actually moving from here to here, and I don't want to, to attack into the mountains through the river, so this guy is just going to stand there for the time being. Uh, right. Uh, Let's actually support this now. Uh, are they attacking here? No. And there are some Polish units moving in, so that's good. Uh, is this province actually optimal here? Sort of. And not really. Mm, 
Actually, it's spread it to two because, well, more than four. Yeah, that makes more sense. And I wait for the organization to uh, to reach more or less its peak for, for the sake of speed. And then we will try to throw all of our planes into Eastern Germany and just grab a little bit of the air superiority there. Uh, they don't have a lot of it in here neither, but... Uh, I think that actually securing this one is more important. Okay, can we? Okay, so grab this. Can we grab that? And those Polish units here are actually quite useful. Uh, of course, we ca cannot get too complacent because, like, one. Uh, one aggressive tank commander can pretty much assure that we get... Uh, <laughs> uh, he can just beeline through a, a, a hole in our lines and get to Prague and we are done. So, yeah, that's... What I'm doing here is quite dangerous, but I think, well... Unless I get too distracted, we should survive. Alright, so we have now... Okay, so three of you... Go through here. Uh, three of you. Okay, this is a fat, fat line. But three of you go through here. Three of you just rush Berlin, actually. And two of you help here and go all the way. Uh, how does it look? Yeah, makes sense. So, I guess we can do the right. Something like that. Probably not going to work, but uh... wait, what? We're supposed to. Pretty sure I ordered you to move there. Like what the hell? Wait, bloody cancelled it? I really don't think so. Oh, there you go. Hmm, what do we have here? Uh, well, that seems very easy to capture, and yeah, we can push our way towards Nuremberg, so let's do that. Uh, keep them occupied here, just try to attack on the fairly wide front, perhaps. We do have some Polish units holding the line here. Uh, that's okay, you are reinforcing there. Let's keep them busy. Mm-hmm. I want them to, to re, uh, regain some organization, but uh, yeah, it's, might as well assign you to this. Well, we are almost there when it comes to conquering munition and getting the achievement. Of course, we want to win the war with Germany, but yeah, achievement is also a nice thing to have. Uh, yeah, so they have. Okay, let's. Uh, throw them there for the time being. And, okay, so it's annoying that I can, I do not have the, the list of what's what's closest. Like like we used to. At least like give it somewhere like so we can open it to, to check it. Uh, I'm not sure like should I move my uh, my planes to the to Bosnian or is this more optimal? Let's see, they have... Uh, well, actually, they're, they're mostly covering the area. Okay, let's try that. That's what... Uh, missing 22 to cover the area, if we were to move them. Missing 23, alright, so, so this is actually better. Yeah, but I... Uh, maybe, maybe I'm missing something. Is there, like... Uh, 
No, that doesn't seem to be like a tooltip showing up. What's what the difference is going to be? Hmm. Not a fun. Of course, that's not a. Uh, uh, that of course is not a review. Just just me complaining. Uh, Huh. Yeah, that's gonna be tough. Oh man. Alright, so let's just put the fallback line because this is getting ridiculous. Uh okay, we're actually getting pushed out of there. Let's let's try to reinforce this. Yeah, the day suddenly have quite a lot of divisions around around Minish. Really don't want us having the the whole. And this is getting up well ever so slightly. Can we please deploy the the, the cover yet? Nope. A few more percent. We need to, to have ten, how is it? Eight, seven? I you need twenty actually, so yeah. That's 17. Mm, okay, but we are moving more or less unopposed here. That should be interesting. They captured Poznan though, and... Mm. I should have a good pipe. Why is it bypassed? Okay, uh, yeah, I think that those are so national folk is complete this this we've been earlier. Okay, this is confusing. No, we actually didn't where we where was it bypassed? So Okay, I actually should have probably read this, but I could have sworn that you can pick it up as a fifth. Huh. Yeah, this, this is very weird. So we definitely finished this one, right? Because uh, I remember that we wanted to, to get the bonus on the infantry offensive. Which we're already performing, but well. So nothing's perfect. Why was it bloody bypassed? Well, I need I will need to load the game. Uh, you know, the, the the new game, and because you cannot actually read it now. Weird. Could have sworn that you can just pick one of... Pick both and get get five, rather than having to, uh, to rush for this nonsense. Yeah. Huh. Anyway, I'll check, I'll check what's... Uh, well, we'll decide what to pick in the next episode. Uh, we'll either go for, I think, Air Force and or just finish arms exports, something like that. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I hope... Oh, right. Now there is a problem, because uh, as of previous patch, you cannot manually save in Iron Man. So I'm not sure if, I, if my thing is going to save if I just... Uh, pause right now because last save was I'm just looking at it uh, three minutes ago so let's just let it go for a second till I see an auto save going so I'm pretty sure if I escape uh, and exit I mean it's not going to save and yeah so something is gonna gonna get changed uh, Three days here. All right, so we captured something. Jesus, this is annoying. But that kind of just auto save. With the way I'm, uh, I'm, I'm playing the <laughs> such games is it's a massive pain in the ass. Uh, all right, so this is actually, uh, this is becoming a problem here. Ah. Oh. Uh, I really need to take a break after this one, so... Right, let's give it a few more seconds, please. 
All right, what do we want to build though? Since, uh, well, as you can see, it's not ideal. Uh, I think infantry. Oh, okay. Quite a lot here. Mm. Right, so um, one aluminium, one steel at least. And one steel. Please save now. Alright, those, those are full again, so we need to pick something here. Uh, well, well, well. Yeah, let's, let's get the research uh, for that going. As well as... Okay. Already working on that. Uh, medium tanks, uh, probably not without bonuses. So uh, the answer is no. And yeah, let's let's actually get the battlefield support for now. I will want that at some point. Jesus, that's a lot of bloody things. Uh, Well, I just will add one to that. Yeah, by this, uh, well, we are also getting quite a lot of civilian factories, so we can actually catch up. Uh, okay. All right. I don't want to pick that one yet. Can you please bloody save this stupid game? Come on. Now it's probably because... Oh, okay, it's saved now. Right, uh, it's probably because it was messing up the the save somehow. Well, I don't know. I'm sure there is a reason, but the, the, the fact that you can't manually save here or in the Stellaris is really pissing me off for the recording purposes. So, there you go. Anyway, thanks for watching. We are going to continue in the next episode. And, oh, actually, oh, so this is... Like, th there is no event for, for capturing Berlin. I, I literally missed the fact that we captured Berlin. So, hmm. oh well, well. This is good, but I, I think our uh, offensive stalled here. We don't have enough manpower to, to, to push all the way to, to Shetland, I don't think. Uh, well, but I, I think that Poland will be able to to push through pretty easily now, uh, since they they are clearly uh, evacuating this one, uh, worrying about the encirclement. So, yeah, looking good, looking good so far. But if they consolidate in the mainland Germany right here, that will be a tough uh, nut to crack. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.